Now, after countless hours of homework and years of study focused on this very moment, the day has finally arrived. The National College Entrance Exam, held just once a year, got underway around three and a half hours ago and will continue until just before 6 p.m. this evening. Nervous families and friends have been gathered around the test centres to show support for the test takers. Our Oh Jung Yee takes us to the scene. It's early in the morning. Looking tense but determined, students file into the test center to take the college scholastic ability test, or sunung as it's called in Korean. It's the most dreaded exam for high school students as the results of five to six tests determine which universities they get into and the course their lives could take. Slightly over 600,000 students across the country are taking this year's exam. These junior students were here from before the crack of dawn to greet and cheer on their seniors. They've been chanting and holding signs of encouragement. The weather's cold, but their enthusiasm is warming up the entrance of this test center. We came in at 6.30 a.m. We hope our seniors ace the exam and make it into their favorite universities. Sending off their children, parents can't bring themselves to leave the test site. They exchange warm hugs and pray their kids do their best. My daughter studied hard and poured all her effort into preparing for this exam, so I have no doubt she'll do well. I hope other test takers get good results too. I'm a bit nervous. I just hope my daughter does as well on this exam as she has in the past. I'm so proud of her. To ease the morning rush hour on Thursday, many people started work an hour later than usual. Extra buses and subway trains were put into service, and police cars provided special escorts for students running late. Flights are also banned from taking off or landing between 1.05 to 1.40 p.m. to ensure the students are not disturbed during the English listening comprehension part of the test. The exam will end at 5.40 p.m. Students are tested on Korean language, mathematics, English language, Korean history, and subject of their preference in social or natural science. Some choose to take English and another foreign language as well. It's a long and draining day for these students tackling a series of exams that could shape their lives forever. Oh Jung-hee, Arirang News.